Hey guys, welcome back to Fix It Philip. Thanks for watching. Uh, we're just gonna be doing an oil change on this 4.0 Toyota. It's a 1 GRFE motor. This is a 2010 Tacoma. Uh, a lot of Toyotas have it, 4Runners, some Tundras, FJ Cruisers, and a lot of Tacomas. So, uh, pretty quick job for this oil change. So, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. We're just gonna do it on the floor, we're just gonna do it old school. So, these have an oil filter right on top, which is nice. So, we're just gonna go underneath and drain the oil. Okay, it's just a 14 millimeter drain plug. Let that drain out. Okay, we've got the spin on oil filter on top. You could take this uh, cover off if you want, but you don't have to. There's a little spout here on the bottom. I usually just get an empty uh, quart of oil and put that here. So that way, oil doesn't drip down everywhere. You know, it just drips right down into the empty quart of oil so you don't make a mess. Just clean up the mating surface. We've already done some other stuff to this truck. You can check out the other videos. We did a spark plug replacement. We changed the uh, clutch and flywheel on another video. If you want to check those out. Okay, new oil filter. You can get some clean oil here and, and lube up this gasket. Okay, this truck just takes regular 530. Spin that back on. Just snug it down. Okay. Tighten this back up. Okay, oil filter is snug down. Drain plugs tighten back down on the bottom. This one just calls for 530. It calls for five and a half quarts 
we'll start with five quarts and run it and get all the oil circulating through the new oil filter and then we'll check it we don't want to overfill it so we'll just start with five Here's two, here's three. Four. Five. You got the dipstick here on the passenger side. Okay, right now we're just at the full mark here on the second dot. Like I said, we'll fire it up, get oil circulating through this new oil filter, and then we'll recheck it. Check it again. Yep. About half a quart low. Okay, we're good. So there's your low mark. There's your full mark there. So you want to get it right up to here without overfilling it. Check it one more time just because. Yep, and we're good. Now we got to reset the maintenance required light. I'll show you guys how to do that. So we're going to reset this maintenance required light here. So what you want to do is if you're on trip A or trip B, you want to make sure it's showing the odometer reading right here. Turn the ignition off. Then hold the trip button. And turn the ignition to the on position without starting it. And you'll see these dots start counting down. Three, two, one. Keep holding it to where it goes back to the odometer. And the maintenance light will be reset. Now some Toyotas, if it doesn't work on the odometer setting, you got to do it on the trip A setting. This one is on the odometer setting. So that's it, we're good to go. Okay guys, that's it for the oil change on this one GRFE 4.0 Toyota engine. Uh, we also did a clutch and flywheel job on this motor. There's a video for that. And also a spark plug replacement as well. So thank you guys for watching. And remember with Fix-It Philip, you can fix it. I'll see you next time.